Ladies and gentlemen, I am standing by with our honorary chairperson, Bob Knight, and I'm so happy to have you here. You were here last night. Is everybody treating you good? Well, of course they are, because Indiana people are very polite, very good. And I always thought when I was coaching that uh, I was very, very fortunate to have an opportunity uh, to coach a team in front of Indiana fans because they were the best there ever was. Well, you were just telling me that you do know uh, some people in the horse racing industry, Wayne Lucas. Uh, tell us a little bit about that. <laughs> I, uh, I got to know Wayne. He was a big basketball fan, and, and I got to know a little bit about the horse races. And, and uh, in fact, I think I was even involved with Wayne with a few horses now and then. And we had a couple that ran well and a couple that couldn't shoot very well. I mean, we, 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 I had better basketball players than I had horses over the time. <laughs> All right, well now to, thanks for talking to me, Coach, and now to uh, welcome up our CEO, Rod Radcliffe, and our COO, uh, Jim Brown, to do a special presentation. On behalf of Rod and I and the 2,000 team members of Centaur, we're honored and privileged to have you serve as our honorary chairperson for the 23rd running of the Indiana Derby and as a small memento of what you bring to us, this is a plaque representing that. I, I not only appreciate uh, the opportunities that I'm having here with you and your folks and the nice people that are here. But, but more than I, I could tell you, I want to thank you for an opportunity you have given me to thank the Indiana fans that were here when I was coaching. And uh, I, 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 I felt uh, during my entire career that there was no place to coach like Indiana. And it wasn't certainly because of the university, it was because of the people and the fans across the state and, and the people that, uh, that thanked us for what we did with our players. So I'll always, always have a great appreciation for you folks in Indiana uh, that supported the teams that we had. Thank you, Coach. And as an IU graduate, who was in Bloomington during the perfect season and the years surrounding it. Thank you for everything you've done for the state of Indiana, and thank you for the history, the legacy, and the success and your contributions to Indiana basketball and Indiana athletics and thank you for being you, and thank you for sharing tonight with us. Well, it's, uh, I, uh, I, as, as, <clears throat> as I said, that uh, regardless of what happened, uh, I will never, ever, ever think anything about Indiana fans other than that they're the best there ever was. And I appreciate yeah. I, I often hear from Indiana fans. I run into Indiana fans when I go here and there. And I want all you folks from Indiana that were involved with uh, watching basketball and rooting. And, and hell, I even like those of you that rooted for Purdue. And, and you were, didn't make any difference where the game was and who was playing and who the fans were rooting for, but it was always, at a game, the very best fans that the nation has, Indiana fans. So thank you very much. Thank you, Coach. Enjoy the rest of the evening and the Indiana Derby.